Well, it's Friday, and we got to find a good movie to watch. That's why we got our buddy from lights-camera-jackson.com, Jackson Murphy, on the line. How are you? Hey, Randy. Happy start of the fall movie season. Oh, fall. Though, I don't know if I like fall in that uh, thing, but, but I guess if there's, if there's good movies, that's okay. Uh, <laughs> now, we've got a little something for everybody today, including a brand new drama that's out. Yeah, drama for adults in theaters called The Card Counter. This is a new gambling and your past comes back to haunt you drama oscar isaac tiffany haddish ty sheridan and willem dafoe strong cast there written and directed by paul schrader he did a film in 2018 with ethan hawk called first reform that was very good so i think a lot of people who like that movie are definitely going to want to see the card counter Ooh, i bet there's going to be a lot of smoldering eye contact in that one Oh, yes, absolutely. <laughs> There's a horror movie out this weekend, too, right? Malignant in theaters and on HBO Max, the latest horror film from director James Wan. He directed the original Saw, the original Insidious, the original The Conjuring, also did Aquaman. So is this his next franchise? The story basically are these dreams and nightmares that the characters are experiencing actually part of real life. That's all you need to know is go in and get all those scares when it comes to malignant. Ooh, boy, he's got some uh, heritage there, so that could be a good one. Um, There's a comedy out now with Kristen Bell as well, right? It's very funny. Queen Pins, inspired by a true story of a multi-million dollar extreme couponing crime. Kristen Bell, Kirby Howell Baptiste, they were on good place together veronica mars their terrific chemistry also in this vince vaughn and paul walter hauser the comedy duo of the year so funny so entertaining i love this script it's very smart so queen pins is going to be on paramount plus on september 30 but you can see it in cinemark theaters starting this weekend so one near us is in west Springfield, if you happen to be in that area, you go to the uh, West Springfield 15. If you also happen to be going all the way to Rochester, it's at that Cinemark Theater. So I do recommend this one. It is very funny. It's a lot of driving. It better be good, Jackson. <laughs> it is. It's worth it. Don't worry. It's worth it. All right. We're talking to Jackson Murphy, our favorite movie reviewer. Although uh, now you're reviewing something different. What do you got here? Well, I got to mention that my pal Jay Leno has a new game show. It's You Bet Your Life added. It's him reuniting with Kevin Eubanks, a new take on the classic game show. Preview episode Sunday at 7.30. Official series premiere Monday at 6.30. And then it's regular time slot at six nights at 7 on the CW15. Jay's also got a new season of Jay Leno's Garage that starts on the 22nd on CNBC. So it's great to see him doing a lot on TV again. I uh, was thrilled to be on The Tonight Show with him twice in 2011 and 2012. And uh, so thrilled to watch him now on this new game show. Oh, that's good. Any uh, behind the scenes you can tell us on Jay Leno? Well, oh, he is great. He is he is so funny. He is one of the nicest people I've ever met. Genuinely funny. When he came here to Proctor a few years ago, I got to go backstage with him and chat with him. Actually, that was when he was just about to start Jay Leno's Garage. So we were uh, the CNBC show. So we were talking about that a little. Yeah, he is uh, he is fantastic. Awesome, Jackson Murphy, our favorite movie reviewer. People uh, can go online and find all your stuff. Where do they go? That's right. Twitter at LCJ Reviews, Instagram at Lights Cam Jackson, and the website is lights camera jacksoncom Perfect. Thank you, Jackson. Have a great weekend. You too, Randy. Thank you.